Hey Scorpio, thank you for tuning in for this message with me. Please take whatever resonate, leave whatever don't. Everything may not apply to everyone because this is a general message, not personal. All information is listed in the description of this video. Um, how to book a personal with me, uh, my Patreon for those who are wanting more of me. Um, I do dailies, weeklies, monthlies, meditation sessions, um, chakra readings crystal readings protection and so much more definitely tune in over there that link again is listed in the description um extended readings as well um and for those who are new i am a psychic medium so i do not use any cards or any tools in your personal readings or in live question and answers you can definitely tune in on wednesdays or saturdays to to get a question answered um, Wednesdays is between 7 and 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. Saturdays is between 1 and 2 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. Um, I also provide games so you can get a chance to win and get a question answered as well. All right. All right. Let's get into your message, Scorpio. Scorpio spirit. Scorpio. Let's see what's going on for Scorpio energy at this time. During this week, spirit, please show us a message for Scorpio. Scorpio, Scorpio, let's see, what is it, Scorpio, Scorpio, let's get one more, one more for Scorpio, oh, okay, all right, Scorpio, um, we have codependency. Someone could be codependent on you, you codependent on them, or there's just the energy that's surrounding a connection or your person or you, take it however, but the codependency could definitely be some type of addiction, Um, but addictions are affecting your romantic life. So whether this is pertaining to the person that you're with and they have some addictions they need to work on, or this is you, just be real, what's up? We have calling in your soulmate. Your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help bring you together. And then guess what's after that? Soulmate. <laughs> yes, this is your soulmate. So, voila. Someone could have been praying for their soulmate to come in. Their soulmate is coming in. And here go your soulmate. Okay. Um, and I just heard the song, uh, Closer Than Close. When? <laughs> All right, now. And then um, we also have finances and career. Financial issues are affecting your love life right now. So this could be the codependency. Maybe someone is codependent on finances and this could be blocking their love life or blocking uh, the connection between you and them. Um, but let's see what else want to come out in this message spirit. Show us more on this energy for Scorpio. Scorpio, you have the butterfly relationship evolved into the next phase, healing the inner child and growth. All right. So, yeah. Show us more for Scorpio. Passion, insane chemistry, like each other equally. Okay. Anything else for Scorpio? All right, someone could be avoiding a conversation with you or you're avoiding a conversation with them. Or there's someone from someone's past who um, someone is still angry or hurt or just disgusted. <laughs> Dang, disgusted. <laughs> someone disgusted. Like, ugh, I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> so there could be what's going on. Like maybe someone don't want to talk to someone from their past. You don't want to talk to someone from your past. However, um, but yeah, it looked like a relationship, a soulmate connection is evolving to the next phase. Let's get more on this energy. Let's see the present the present energy for Scorpio. Show us the present energy for Scorpio. Show us the present energy for Scorpio. Show us the present energy. The present energy for Scorpio spirit. Let's get it. Let it come out. Present energy. We have the world. So you and this person could be at a distance from each other. You could be in separation at this time. 
but um a cycles is is wrapping up you know we in a, the season of scorpio that speaks up endings and beginnings new beginnings and then as i said um a relationship evolving to the next phase healing the inner child and growth so there's definitely a change um a cycle changing for you in love um hmm. let's see Let me get one more on the world for Scorpio present energy. The world, clarify the world. Four cups. Yeah, you're missing someone. Someone is missing you. I feel like you're codependent on each other. Energy on each other because this this is a deep connection. Let's get more. Um, what is Scorpio desires with this person, with this soulmate? What is Scorpio desires? You want to protect it? And what is um this person? What is this soulmate this person desires with Scorpio? What is this person desires with Scorpio? The judgment. They want to renew things. They want to come back together. So that's why I was picking like separation or you and this person could be apart. They're desiring to come back together. They're desiring to... um you know, fix this, or it's not, it's nothing broken, I'm not getting, it's just, you know, to uh, bring it back together, they're wanting to um, have a union, a home, a family with you, or, yeah, uh, this also speaks of, like, twin flame connection, 11-11, so that could be significant as well, some of you could be dealing with the Aries or another Scorpio, um, let's get uh Someone could be dealing with a Capricorn as well. So let's see what will be helpful for a Scorpio in this soulmate connection. What would be helpful for a Scorpio to go forward and, you know, offer your love and continue to give in to this connection? So this would be helpful for you. Okay, so it's not a bad thing for you to give in to this. Yeah, I'm not getting any bad out of this situation. That's a good thing. Mm. So, what is the obstacle? I feel like the obstacle is the distance. Um, what is the obstacle for Scorpio and his connection? What is the obstacles? Hmm. Hidden feelings. The obstacles is your hiding feelings. Their their hiding feelings, or you both aren't speaking up completely on how you feel about each other it's coming out in this reading though let's see more on the moon um so the the obstacle is secrets show us more on the moon with the obstacle show us more on this moon clarify the moon clarify the moon for scorpio yeah secrets and it's keeping it stuck or keeping you stuck in your head or keeping this person stuck in their head because of the secrets. Show us more on the, uh, on the moon and the eight of swords. What are these secrets? The secrets need to be revealed. Communication needs to be had. So, yeah, you and someone need to open up and communicate. Show us more on the obstacles. About a home situation, a living situation. Or about um, someone, someone wanting to commit to, to coming towards you or you commit to going towards someone. Someone needs to speak their truth on how they feel. Someone is, it's just a lot of attraction and passion between you and this person. Yeah, passion did come out. Insane chemistry, like each other equally and also having fun. So this could be very a uh, very spontaneous connection, um, but... Yeah, even the four of wands came out again. Someone could be very cautious. I don't know. I just feel like maybe someone is cautious because they feel like this is right and they don't want it to be wrong. So they just move it slow. <laughs> um, so what is the near future? What's in the near future? What's in the near future for Scorpio? Near future. Not the sun in reverse. So, in the near future, it looks like there's no clarity. Someone is not happy. Why? Show us more on the sun in reverse. 
Why is this coming out in the near future? Clarify the sun in reverse for the near future. Five of Cups, sadness, regret over a loss. So someone could be regretting or unhappy because they may, someone may be losing you or you losing. Show us more on the Five of Cups and the sun in reverse. Who is this and why is this here? Ace of Cups, new love. So someone have new love. So in the near future, someone could be sad. I feel like this could be the ex, someone who you like, nope, not today. I don't want to talk to you. Um, or this person. However, it looked like someone is this not pertaining to you and your person, whoever the soulmate connections or twin flame. Some of you is a twin flame. Some of you is a, just the soulmate. So some of you, if it's a twin flame, it's a soulmate twin flame because it's that's just how it works. But if it's a just a soulmate, then it's just a soulmate. But um, however, this connection is is it's looking like in the near future. There's some sadness and regret over an opportunity and love with you because you may have new love and that new love is with this with this person whoever this is um show us more on the ace of cups the ace of cups for scorpio in their future eight of wands yeah something is about to take off for you in love yeah family ten of pentacles seven of pentacles yeah you're about to invest in a family um, it looked like you and this person could be re really wealthy together. The Ten of Pentacles speaks of wealth. Um, and then it's a, it's a, a man and a woman. You know, this could be husband and wife. This could be just your partner. Don't necessarily have to be marriage. But however it is, this is this speaks of wealth. So you and someone coming together, you combine in assets or just, you know, just by your energies coming together, you're gaining this wealth together because... After the Eight of Wands, it's showing the Seven of Pentacles to the Ten of Pentacles. So you're building together, and then you're going to obtain as well together. So that's good. But um, someone is regretting, possibly um, they're missing the opportunity with you. They missed the opportunity with you. They're not happy. It could be a Leo. Um, it could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. Um, Whoever it is, regardless of the sign, though, it's just the energy. And the energy is someone is not happy because um, you have new love. That's in the near future. Okay. Um, I'm going to extend this and find out uh, the fears, like what's holding this back or what's, um, what's taking this so long. <laughs> uh, what are the fears? How this person is viewing you? How you view this person? Your soulmate, um, or twin flame, uh, your wish out of this situation. Will that wish come true? The outcome and an oracle message. All right, Scorpio. But yeah, it looked like a soulmate connection is coming together. Um, and it looked like someone from the past is uh regretting their their chance with you. Wow, I didn't even notice this at the bottom. You have love, unconditional love. Self-love one is passion, affection, attraction. So, yeah. That is it, Scorpio. Thank you so much for tuning in. Um, If you want to have access to the extended reading, you can definitely tune in to Patreon uh, and join the membership for the weekly uh, readings. And you will be able to tap in with us because I'm about to go live over there to extend this reading. All right. And until next time, or just, you know, if you don't or can't at this time, uh, you can just look out for the next time I post, which will be sometime next week. All right. But many blessings.